morning and welcome to another video uh, as you could see I just got the Mavic Mini after a long wait uh, it took like two and a half months to get it overseas because I ordered it back in August uh, shipped it to my aunt and then she sent it but the package in the way is it was supposed to arrive a month one month it finally arrived after two and a half and I was really worried at some point that it would not come but we finally have it, we finally have our drone and as you can see we floated it a bit problem is winter came and it's not the best season uh, for flying your drone especially if you're a rookie because uh, you can crash it quite easily and if you land it in snow then some problems might occur uh, the other thing is um, also the regulation of the drones uh, are really strict uh, in the past couple of years actually this year and uh, I did it a couple of times already as you can see it's in the middle of the city but if I will get caught I will go to jail for a sentence up to one year I guess so we'll have to figure that out how we're gonna solve this because back in the days this was not a problem but we have to see how we will solve it now on the other hand is as you know we've been to israel which was definitely amazing and more things about that it was supposed to come out on a vlog but somehow the audio didn't record it itself i don't know what happened but let's go to the gym Let's hit some legs and we'll talk after. I can tell you this was a fucking killer workout for the legs we have leg press lunges extensions uh, which were in the last part and I didn't film them uh, and then we had all the things we have to do for calves we did crunches for abs so it was a killer killer workout uh, and we finished off with a bit of cardio just to relax our muscle now, the thing is with Israel, we've been over there, it was a really amazing place and if you are worried to go to Israel because of the media, you should not listen 
at all because there are no problems over there. Yeah, there are some small problems with uh, missiles in the south part down in Gaza, but that's not affecting the major cities as Tel Aviv, Haifa, Jerusalem, uh, Nazareth, and so on. And so you're safe. The people are really, really nice, and we had a blast. Uh, my, the friend of mine, and her friend actually, she was really, really amazing. She was the kindest person ever, like, she hosted us, she drove us around, like, the whole country. Uh, she was our host, um, the, actually, besides one day, <laughs> she was our host, and the, her parents were amazing as well. So the people are really welcoming, they're really friendly, they all speak English. So I highly advise you to go over there to Israel. One uh, small problem would be if you go back, like you arrived at the airport, be sure you're on time because we were secure. Uh, the security check, we got a full security check. I don't know for what reason, me and my friend as well. Like, I know what was the reason for me, kind of and it was a cream and a uh, bath salt but I already told them in the before that can I take this because it's sealed and stuff and oh, yeah, yeah we will talk about it later and stuff and and we got into a security room they went through all my stuff even my toothbrush and it was really not a funny story considering my situation I've been to many many airports and I knew how this thing should work and I was like yeah I, I got pretty angry at that point and I was not friendly but in the end yeah, I sold it actually and what happened is the airport security put those two things in a bag and they shipped it to Ryanair no cost so at the end of the day I sold it even though it took me more time and, and we had luckily enough time so yeah it was alright but all in all uh, the thing in Israel is really cool. One thing, it's a bit expensive. It's a true story. Uh, yeah, considering uh, if you pay in the whole Europe, you'll never pay around 8, 9 euros for a beer. That should be considered expensive. Food, on the other hand, um, doesn't stand out as much. But don't go to McDonald's because that's way more expensive than going to a regular restaurant. Facts. And that's pretty much it. If you want to go to a beach in November, instead of freezing up in Romania at zero or minus degrees, just go over there and I promise you, I think we'll go back in a year or two. Uh, so, yeah. That's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the drone footage. You hope you enjoyed the workout with me. And uh, next week, we are going to shopping to show you how the book is going, what you should eat, on the budget, again, we'll make a 40 or $50 worth of budget uh, meal plan for you to bulk. And it's going to be amazing, whole foods. So stick around and see you the next week.